Hi guys, what's up and welcome back to my channel. Before we get started on today's video, I wanted to give a shout out to my streaming server. The link to join is down below. We talk about a bunch of different games, anime, K-pop, literally anything, and you can be notified when I go live on Twitch. So make sure to join with the link that is in the description box down below. Okay, to get started, you're first going to want to grab your Switch dock. You'll notice on the back there is a USB port there, but I choose not to use that port because you do have your AC adapter and the HDMI cable there as well. I like to use the ones on the side, and you're just going to need any generic USB uh, keyboard like this Dell one, and you're simply going to take the USB and plug it in on the side, and that's basically step one. So once you have that in the side of your switch, you're going to want to go to your settings on your switch. You're going to scroll all the way down to the controllers and sensors, and you're going to scroll down to the option of Pro Controller Wired Communication. This is going to be off. You are going to want to turn it on. This is going to allow you to use that USB port, and you're going to be able to now type in Animal Crossing New Horizons. So you're going to want to close this out and then load up your game. Now that you are in your game, you can just click on your right controller to bring up the little text box like you normally would, and now your keyboard works perfectly. All the numbers work, all the other extra characters work, and you can even hit the return button to send it in-game. Just a few extra notes about this method. You do have to be playing the game on your TV. If you choose to use your Switch handheld, this USB keyboard will not work for you. You will still have to peck with your little fingers on the screen. But if you are playing on the TV, it is great. It is so much faster to communicate and talk to people. And I honestly prefer it over using the joystick and clicking A, or even using the Nintendo Online app to type in-game. I hope you guys found this video helpful, and if you have any problems or any video suggestions that you would like to see on this channel in the future, please let me know down in the comments. I would love to respond to you guys. And with all that said, I hope you guys have a magical day, and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye!